Hey y'all. So, some people don't even really know why they don't like you. Some people don't even know why they don't like you. You know, somebody might say, why is she always coming out here talking about friendships? Because I've been there. Because I have been, I have gone through the experience with it. Listen, if you've been following me for a amount of time or whatever, you know, I always say whether it's on my podcast, whether it's on my uh, YouTube page, whether it's on the other TikTok page, I always say um, I, I don't talk about nothing that I ain't been through. Like, if I'm telling you this, this is because I've been through it, right? Because people like to receive and they can relate, pun intended. Seriously, though. People want to know that other people have had the same experience they experienced. So I ain't talking just out the side of my neck. You know what I'm saying? I've been there. But yeah, people really don't even know why they don't like you. They'll they'll not like you out of loyalty to that person that person that doesn't like you. And you don't even know why. You don't like this person. So you unfollowing, you unfriending, you not talking to such and such no more because the friend doesn't like you. But y'all, that's idolization. That is called friendship idolization. It's so easy. You see how it's so easy to idolize something or somebody? We don't want to do that. You don't want to make anything or any person an idol, right? Even in friendships. Allow God to tell you about the person. Ask God. That's why it's so imperative. I say that too. Ask God about everybody. Now, sometimes God will tell you, yeah, no, mm -mm. Walk, walk away, keep away from this person, right? God will tell you that. God will tell you anything. All you got to do is ask him. But then he'll also say, it's nothing wrong with that person. It's okay to be friends with that person. So, remember too, we wrestle not against flesh and blood. So, the people that don't like you or you don't even know why they don't like you, or they don't even know why they don't like you, like I started this video, is, you know, people also wrestle with demons. Because the Bible says we wrestle not against flesh and blood. So, give them grace. Forgive them. Forgive them. We're supposed to be forgiving people anyway. But yeah, forgive the people that don't like you. Right? I get it. I know the word jealousy, it seemed like it's, it can be overused or like especially in the social media streets like you always hearing about somebody saying somebody jealous of somebody right or 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 somebody got this amount of haters or whatever you know what i'm saying i get it but jealousy really is a real thing jealousy is all over the, especially in proverbs it's so many scriptures and proverbs on jealousy y'all i'm telling you go read your bible right it really is a real thing and so there are people that really are jealous of people there are people that really are haters and it's a really real thing and i know how some people like everybody don't everybody don't hate you don't everybody got haters but there really are some haters out there okay and they really some people really do have haters it's a real thing but give them grace give these people grace forgive them like i said some people don't even know why they don't like you you know what I'm saying? Some people just literally have demons in them that they need to be delivered from. And that helped me understand it better and helped me to forgive them even better or more. Give them more grace, okay? And because God said so too, because he want us to forgive everybody, right? Forgive your enemies, right? So I just wanted to just drop that nugget for y'all. Some people don't even know why they don't like you, but give them grace and forgive them anyway. Love y'all. But know that God loves you more. Okay, bye.